Hi guys, my name is Yamak. Welcome back to my channel. I'm a medical doctor and today we have another new gadget we are unboxing. This is the Google Nest Hub second generation. I got this one for Black Friday on a discount so it was a great deal and um, I'm really curious on how this will function. Um, so far I know there are three main functions. It has, it's a digital photo frame. You can link it up to your Google account and uh, if you had a Google Photos app, you can select which albums you want to put on display. So it's a great way to relive your uh, old memories. And besides of that, it has a built-in speaker and you can use it for media playback, Spotify or YouTube or uh, Netflix when, you, when you're cleaning the house, for example. And of course, it has Google Assistant incorporated. So you can say, hey Google, and then ask all questions or set up reminders and um, probably uh, much more. So let's unbox it and see what's inside. All right. Oh, there it is. Right away. With the speaker. All right. I think there's not much more to it. Let's see what else we have. The charging cable. So there's not much more to it actually. It's really simple. I like that. It's clean. <laughs> so that was a short unboxing, <laughs> I guess. <laughs> but uh, let's open it and uh, set up my account, of course. This is the most fun part. All right. I logged in with my account and set up the device. Like, we, like I said, it has a beautiful digital picture frame, 7 inch display, so it's great to, uh, to see your videos and uh, your photos. And let's see, you can see your Netflix, YouTube and Spotify accounts here. And um, well, probably you can also play some games I see. Well, maybe we'll try that in a different time. What's interesting is it's a very simple device with gestures and it has two buttons on the back. You have a mic switch, you can turn off the mic, so it's really handy. And the volume rocker here on the side. And here is a sensor which is called a motion sensor. You can use it for gestures. Uh, you can also put it in the sleeping room and use it for sleep sensing and probably it, it will help you improve your sleep and get a, a better night's rest it's a really simple device and let's let's try it out hey google what's the weather currently in arnhem it's seven degrees and partly cloudy tonight the forecast is around four with scattered showers let's go back Hey Google, set a timer for five minutes. All right, five minutes, and we're starting now. So you see, you can uh, give a lot of commands to Google, set up reminders, and it's also linked to other uh, features. And when you swipe from the left, you can go back to your main page. And if you go up, you will see the settings page. You can adjust the brightness right here and it will also auto adjust according to the light in the room and let's see and you can change the volume again let's go to settings so it's really easy to navigate and i think that's really good it should be easy you can use your voice you can use gestures and also you can swipe all right that's it for the first impressions I will make a more in-depth review maybe in a year or something we'll see but so far so good all right guys what do you think of the google nest hub do you have any questions or comments please leave them in the comment section below and uh, hit the like button and subscribe it will help the channel grow a little bit thank you and i will see you in the next one